Welcome back to Terra Mater Gardens, and welcome to our exploration of Jerusalem Sage, a stunning perennial herb renowned for its unique appearance and versatile uses in the garden. Did you know that Jerusalem Sage is not actually native to Jerusalem? Despite its common name, it originates from the Mediterranean region, including Southern Europe and North Africa. Its name, Jerusalem Sage, likely stems from its historical use in herbal medicine and religious rituals. Jerusalem sage has a rich history dating back centuries and has been cultivated for both ornamental and medicinal purposes since ancient times. Jerusalem sage is characterized by its woody stems, gray-green foliage, and whorls of hooded yellow flowers arranged in tiers along the stems. The leaves are aromatic and have a slightly fuzzy texture, providing contrast and visual interest in the garden. The drought tolerant perennial typically reaches a height of 2-3 to three feet and forms a bushy shrub-like habit. Jerusalem sage is well suited to Mediterranean climates and thrives in full sun to partial shade. It prefers well-draining soil and is tolerant of poor soil conditions, making it an excellent choice for rocky or sandy soils. Once established, it is drought tolerant and requires minimum maintenance. Prune back the stems after flowering to encourage bushier growth and prolong the plant's lifespan. Jerusalem sage makes a striking addition to mixed perennial borders, Mediterranean-style gardens, and drought-tolerant landscapes. Its vertical stature and silvery foliage provide a stunning contrast when planted alongside a low-growing ground cover or brightly-colored flowering plants. Pair it with lavender, rosemary, or ornamental grasses for a harmonious and visually appealing garden design. In addition to its ornamental value, Jerusalem sage has a long history of medicinal use. It was traditionally used in herbal medicine to treat a variety of ailments, including respiratory issues, digestive problems, and skin conditions. While its medicinal properties are not commonly utilized today, Jerusalem sage still adds a touch of historical significance in modern gardens. Additionally, the dry stems and flowers can be used in floral arrangements or dried, with, or dried herb wreaths for decorative purposes. Thank you for joining us on this journey into the world of Jerusalem Sage. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more gardening tips, plant profiles, and inspiration.